Thank you, Eric. The cleanup continues this morning after strong storms leveled trees, leaving thousands without power in Lafayette and West Lafayette. We first brought you team coverage of the aftermath yesterday morning. Well, power is restored now to most customers. It happened sometime this morning, more than 24 hours after that storm. Duke Energy saying a peak of 10,000 customers lost electricity just after midnight yesterday. News 18 continues to get reports of significant damage, including tree trunks and branches down on cars and homes. You can see a sampling there as well as this submitted video of a transformer exploding early yesterday morning in Lafayette. Energy companies now and highway departments out in full force right now, even this morning, clearing the streets. James Hurst says he was at work when a tree fell and nearly hit his home on Elmwood Avenue. There's over half the road blocking traffic. And I'm just looking at it thing from from the will of God. It did not go through my home and, and hurt people inside my home. Her says if you're looking for firewood and you got some spare time and tools, you can chop that tree up yourself and take it with you. West Lafayette Street Commissioner Jeremy Stinson says his crews are preparing for an all week cleanup. He says their first goal is to get the big debris out of the road there.